Today's life lesson comes from high school mathematics. We'll just turn the camera around so that we can have a look. Hey, thank you to LK and LK Logic who posted this on their YouTube channel. So the question we're trying to answer is whether the number 222 to the power of 333 is larger or smaller than 333 to the power of 222. So the two numbers actually look quite different and on the surface of it, it's actually hard to tell which one is larger than the other. But let's just break it down. By about this time, you start to actually notice where the answer is and you might already be able to guess what the solution is. But let's break it down some more. And so we arrive at this and from here you can see that 111 to the power of 222 is the same on both sides. The power, the exponent on both sides is of the second term is the same. So therefore this number must be larger than this number. So and it all comes from the fact that we recognize that 111 is actually a factor of both 222 and 333. So it's actually recognizing that common factor that led us to the solution. I find this to be one of many useful examples of how mathematics represent life. When I work with other people, the natural tendency is to look at the differences between myself and the people that I work with. But usually when I actually take time to break down what the differences are, by the fact that both of us are actually human beings existing in the same plane of existence, I find that they usually are a lot of common ground. And it is understanding the components of us that's different and recognizing the huge amount of common ground that we hold that lead us to be able to find solutions to our problems.